Hello everyone. In this video I'm going to go over making a chandelier in Grounded. It's a very simple process, very fast process. So I'm actually going to do it in my adjacent building. So the first thing is to have two weed, uh, two weed stems. You're going to make the windowed weed stem wall. So come up here. So windowed stem wall is what it's called. Attach that right there to the cross beam of my vaulted ceiling. I'm just going to jump up, complete the build, lag a little bit when I'm because I'm falling. And that is the basic structure of what I how I built my chandelier. Now I'm going to go back and get a bit more building materials. I need something to stand on, so I'm not having to jump constantly. So I'm going to grab one uh, weed stem. And then sake of the video just to make things go a little faster I'm not picky that way I can build one set of stairs and a grass floor so I have my set of stairs which is gonna put me right there and then if I can get it to connect there we go so this is just basically a temporary scaffolding. It will not stay in here. This is just a platform for me to stand on. Now, I already know that I'm going to be making this with five, uh, five sconces on both sides. So, get the sconce blueprint. I always start, I take this little, uh, this little knot in the wood right here in the center as just that, the center. That's where I place my first light. Then on the vertical beam down on each side, I place a light on each side and then I try to split the difference the best I can now if you want to do more than five go for it if you want to do just three works too this is just how I wanted to build it so it's gonna be ten lights total if I can just get these to sit correctly now I'm gonna go back over towards my boxes I'm going to collect all the supplies I need gonna look at the at decor for the sconce lamp I need 10 sap 30 dry grass and 20 sprigs to complete everything so running low on sap 30 chunks of dry grass and 20 sprigs and I just run back over here oops go up the stairs there we go And the reason I built this is just so that I don't have to keep jumping. I can hop, stand right here, look up, do what I gotta do. Because there is the, for me, there's lag when I complete a construction. I'd rather not have that while I'm jumping up and down. Doesn't do so well for video. If you've seen my video on deleting a 22 story uh, a zip line tower, the, the lag gets unreal sometimes. Once I have them all built, that's when I'll turn the light on. Not before game. Thank you. And then we'll build the very last one. And then it's simple. Turn them on. I wait till I have them all built before I turn them on because you see it gets really bright and I don't want to be staring up at that while I'm trying to build. I'd rather be able to just do it like that and done. And then remove what you... Uh, what you built to get up there. And that is a fast, simple chandelier. Like I said, you could put more lights, you could put less lights. The more lights you have, obviously, the brighter it's going to glow. But that is all up to you. That is the uh, beauty of the this. You can create it how you want, but if you wanted something different, if you can see the chandelier through the window right there. That is a really cool look from here. That's just a quick way to do a chandelier. So if you like what you saw in this video, I do stream every day on Twitch. My link will be in the description below. Feel free to stop by the chat, ask me any questions. Uh, but until the next video, y'all have a good one.